referee. You're in charge. Valve. Man, that's all right. I'm the referee. <laughs> Technical. Don't do that. Don't do that. Violation foul. Violation foul. You are the ref. The ref is you. Blow a whistle, time stops. Blow it again, time stops. Charge! <laughs> You're in charge. There's people out there relying on that starting and stopping and starting and the time starting again. So you gotta blow that whistle at the right time to start it and stop it. I'm the referee. Tuck the jersey. I'm the referee. Jump ball. Technical. You got a problem with the car, huh? You got a problem with me? Get the get out of here. I'm the referee. You got this. Blocking. Block, 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 blocking. Hey. Hey, what's up? The game is about to start. Everyone's waiting for you. Cool, cool, cool. Be right there. You good? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. See you out there. The beast moment of your life. Keep it clean and competitive. Obey my rules at all times. Biggest moment of your life. My hair blows up when I'm alone. Inside out, I might explode. I shut my eyes in my mouth and my legs just gave out. Why in the world would you hit me when I'm down? When I'm down? When I'm down? What's up, y'all? Parkour Parker here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's too high. Do it, do it. No, it's too high. Do it, do it. Last week, I asked you guys to vote on which sick move I should try. Jump the gap between these two buildings, or apologize to my sister for not being there enough during our parents' divorce. Today, the votes came in. And you guys decided we're gonna jump the gap! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you got that, man! You ready? <laughs> it's kinda far. <laughs> Bro, you got this. Word, let's run it. I can apologize to my sister another time if she ever starts answering my phone calls again. Yo, come on. But today we're here for another reason. And that's to jump the gap! Yeah! Alright, boys. I'll see you on the other side. I mean, seriously, Garrett. <laughs> I don't care if it's a TikTok trend, there's no farting in the produce. Say that to 47 likes, my boy. Hashtag food fart. <laughs> Uh, moving on uh, to my favorite part of the meeting, Employee of the Month. Oh shit, here we go. This month, the award is going to somebody who comes to work on time with a smile on their face every day. She's the fastest can stacker this side of the Mississippi. She. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for your Employee of the Month, Delaney. What the genuine actual hell. And our little Starbucks gift card for you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really prepare anything to say, oh, so thanks, I guess. Thank you, Delaney. All right, just a couple more announcements before we go. Inventory day is moving to Sunday. It's a literal joke. You need goddamn comedy. Shh. Is there a problem, Jake? I just said it's funny. Sorry? I said it's funny as literal hell. Inventory day moving to Sunday? No, Delaney. Like, seriously, she's the employee of the month. Jake, she's a great employee. She doesn't even know what aisle yogurt is on. Aisle three. Lucky guess. Employee of the month isn't about knowing things. It's about being a fundamental part of this community. It's about being there for 
the customers, and each other. It's about being a voice for the unheard. Jake, if you're upset, you weren't selected. Me? No, no, I'm a terrible employee. <laughs> okay. I'm talking about the real employee of the month. Todd. Todd is the best thing that's ever happened to this place. Todd's practically senile, Jake. If Todd was senile, could he do this? Well, we're not supposed to touch the merchandise without gloves on, so... Good eye, Todd. That's my employee of the month. Okay, Jake, settle down. It's not even like Todd wants it that bad, do you, Todd? Yeah. Oh, sure. Of course he doesn't want it. That's what makes him so worthy. <laughs> He's the most humble man that I've ever met. When I'm having a hard day and I walk through those doors, I hear Todd's breathing and wheezing from five hours down, and I know in that moment I'm gonna be okay. That's why Todd's my best friend. Guys, can I just like accept this award and we all go home? Last year, my husband and I got divorced and my son Parker refused to come home. But when Todd heard me crying in the break room and he like weaselly walked on by, it was as if to say life goes on. See, that's why Todd is my best friend too. As many of you might not know, I was arrested a few months back. Oh, yeah, we were talking about it. We definitely time. heard. My one phone call, Todd. I asked him to bail me out, and he laid out some pretty severe wheezes. <laughs> some of them sound like they could be his last breath and shit. And then he hung up on me. I learned a valuable lesson that day to serve my time and face the consequences of my actions. That's why Todd is my best friend, my carnal. Okay. 24 years ago, my father found out he was infertile. My parents were devastated. They wanted kids so badly. They, they even picked out names on the second date. They eventually went with a sperm donor, and it was hard, but it worked. And nine months later, there I was. A beautiful 14 pound, eight ounce oh, baby. fuck. I know. Whoa. Yep. A blessing and a curse, my mom called it. And that's why Todd's my father. What? What? And my best friend. And my best friend. Oh. I love him. He's the best. Todd! 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 Todd. 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 This is Todd. ridiculous. Todd. 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 Todd! Todd! I think I know what I have to do. Delaney? You're fired. <laughs> yeah! Todd? You're the employee of the month. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Let's go, Todd! 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 Todd. 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 Yeah, fired mom. Yes, as in I don't work there anymore. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you later. Five dollars. Martin, I am just saying you can work for your cousin Doug at the orthodontist office. You see that girl that was selling lemonade for five dollars? Lemonade is worth five dollars. What do you need? The sugar, lemon, some water, low overhead, high profits. Lemonade. Four fifty. Four dollars. Three fifty. Here you go. Thank you. The Bible says, once you touch the forbidden fruit, there's no going back. One day, Huyen, this will all be ours. These lemons are taking over our lives, buddy! From now on, you only sell lemons to me. Yes, whatever you say, Mr. Daniel, just don't shoot. I just want to go back to the mine. I used to know. That Martin is gone. My life, I wouldn't do that to you, man. Some of their partners, man. Come on. Oh, God. <laughs> what the fuck are those Francisco? I am leaving your ass. 
I've committed many sins. It's the one I'm about to commit that worries me. It's all there. Whoops. You fucked with the wrong little kid, Marty. Sorry things turned so... sour. How was your croissant and lettuce? It's really good. It's gonna be ready whenever you are. Actually, can you split this? Yeah, 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 I can try. <laughs> Sorry, no can do. No worries, I'll cover it. Oh, you sure? Yeah, I'll cover it. Perfect, awesome. Uh, and are we gonna be needing validation today? Oh, uh, yes, please. <laughs> You matter. You're important. You're loved. There's a reason you're here. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Absolutely, have a good one. Yeah, come back soon. Thanks. Thanks. What the fuck are these? I just wanted to taste. Tastes too sour for you, Francisco. Tastes too sour. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die. That's my son, what are you doing? I'm really glad we're doing I've been this. having a really good time. Me too. Oh my god, no way. Seriously, there's one last bite. Oh my god, you, know you take it. I want you to have it. You're the one that ordered it. For you to enjoy. <laughs> Fine. <sighs> you know, it's kind of crazy. I've had the best time getting to know you tonight. Same. Really? I just hear where you are. Oh, how much is. No, 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 I got it. Are you sure? Yes, of course. You sure? Yeah, of course. Okay. I don't know if this is too forward, but I'd really like to take you out again soon. I would love that. Yeah? Yeah. Claire. Claire. Kyler, what are you doing here? I, I thought you were on a flight to Chicago. Chicago had my dream job, but not my dream girl. Aww. What the fuck? You've worked your whole life for that position. I could live a thousand lives, Claire, and never meet a girl like you. Aww. Seriously? I realized while sitting in my first class seat that I've spent all this time and energy working on something I thought I needed, but it was just something I wanted. Aww. Okay. When I took us on that incredible month getaway across Europe, eating every single dessert from room service, I knew in that moment what real happiness was. I should have told you how much I love you when you were standing in the rain on top of Niagara Falls and you lost your cute little hat, but I made you feel better with butterfly kisses. Oh, Jesus Christ. I knew in that moment you were my everything. You're my little tiramisu, baby. You're my big banana split. Sir, sir. The tip isn't included, just, just by the way. What the fuck? Yeah. That was awesome.